Welcome to Nosphere channel. This time I will show you how to handle many radio button in vp.net. First, open our Visual Studio. Then create one project. Click file, new and project. And we choose Windows Classic Desktop and Windows Form application. Click OK. Then in here, I will add button first. And to handle many radio button, I will add group box. Let's change background color to easier identifying. The last item not the last, but for radio button, we will make more than one in here. Let's create 10 radio button. Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. For example, like this, or you can also add two again. For countless radio button, this tutorial is sweet for you and I will add text block for the last step okay let double click in button in here now we need to declare Air button first okay we declare radio buttons list in new of radio button in here and this is for looping in button click one okay for this is for group box We add radio button in direct case in here. Now we need to looking for next statement. For each, we declare R in here. Sorry, this is too many 
goods in here. Yes. Brand new button. In air button. Air button is reference to this. If R dot check then we can just get the value of radio button very simple like this using variable r and text like this let's start our project for example i'll check radio button 1 if my comment is right in the text block 1 we'll get radio button 1 text in here okay if radio button 2 so you can create many radio button thousand hundreds or more using this script but you must get or you must place the radio button into the group box okay so you can following code like this and my friend asking how we can use this command and get the text of radio button in another form it's easy we can just add windows form then we can add text block here okay it's enough then we can just add form 2 in here And before we get the text, we show first form to dot show like this. Now we start again our project. If I click radio button one and click button one, you can see it's in the form two or another form. Okay. That's all tutorial how to handle many radio button in Visual Basic VB.net. Hope this helpfully. Thanks for watching and you can get this code in nosware.com. Thank you. Bye bye.